going on you guys so today i am gonna go ahead and do an unboxing of this thing that you see right in front of me you guys already know what it is by the title of this video so let's go ahead and get to opening it first before i touch anything that's inside i am gonna put on these gloves because the package was bought online and it was bought off of mercari so since it is covid season i'm gonna use this as protection as you guys can see on the box it does say fragile handle with care and i did cover my information and it is taped really well as you guys can see too much tape so let's open it so now once I took off the tape I open this flap open this other flap and it does come with these air bubbles I'm going to put on the side and more it is well packaged okay some of them I guess pop anyway it is nice and bubble wrapped it came with whatever this is so let me take it out and I'll Show you what I got so it is nice and bubble wrapped as you guys can see and it is showing that it's a Super Nintendo which it is a complete inbox one so I'm gonna go ahead and take the bubble wrap off take this plastic off and then we can continue so here is the system we are going to take a look at the box first i did get the super nes donkey kong set super nintendo with donkey kong official nintendo seal of quality super nintendo entertainment system controller diddy kong and then it says Go Ape in Donkey Kong Country, game pack included. Set includes Super NES control deck. One Super NES controller, Donkey Kong Country, game pack. This is one side of the box. Another side of the box, which is featuring Mario Paint. The back of the box, which gives you a couple screenshots of Donkey Kong Country, the game. It also has other games that you could buy with this system. This system was bought back in... January 1895 do not remove proof of purchase it also has Super Mario World and it says play it loud Super Nintendo so it is a boxed official Super Nintendo and then it has Advertisement for the Super Scope and Yoshi Safari. And then this is another side of the box. So this is the top, which is the same as the bottom. 
All right, so let's go ahead and open it and see what came inside because this is a used system. So the flap right here, as you can see, this box is ripped. But it does come with all the numbers on the flaps, letting you know that this is the USA model. And it comes with the styrofoam. So let me go ahead and take it out. Okay, I took it out of the box. Now, once you take it out, this is how it comes. This is how mine was packaged from the seller that I bought it from on the app Mercari. So you first get the system. We'll take a look at it right now. You get the consumer information, instruction manual, and some Nintendo Power information. The only thing I didn't get was the instruction manual for the game, which is for Donkey Kong Country. You also get the power brick. It also came with AV cables. The RF out. And mine came bundled with two controllers, which this one would be the controller for the Super Nintendo Mini or Super Nintendo Junior or the second Super Nintendo. They didn't have an official name, but people just came up with that name. But this is the controller that I used on the second model, but the one I got is the first. And then this is the actual original controller that comes with the system. So first what I got here is the Donkey Kong Country game, which is the one that comes bundled with this Super Nintendo. And it does have a dust cover for the game. Let me go ahead and take it off and show you what the dust cover looks like. So this is the dust cover that you would normally get on games when you did buy them. But I heard some information that I was watching online that Nintendo stopped giving these out for the games. But this is the dust cover. I got Donkey Kong. And it is in good shape. All right, the pins inside seem clean. So this is a clean system. All right, so Donkey Kong Country. Next, we get the official Nintendo AC adapter, which you plug in with this plug. And it is the USA plug. And it says caution indoor use only so only use it inside next we get the original rf out which is the nintendo rf switch for the nes control deck and you would connect it to your old tvs through coaxial like so and then this one, you would connect it to the back of your system. Next, you could also connect the Super Nintendo via AB cables, which was the yellow, red, and white, like so. And this one comes with a rubber band. You also get the Super Nintendo controller which is also in good condition. It is clean. The only thing I need to do is just wipe it down, but that's about it. 
And then this is how the other end of the connector looks like. And it is wrapped with rubber band. And then I also got this other one. And it says Nintendo on it. But the original had Super Nintendo. This was the second redesign for the Nintendo Mini, Nintendo Junior, Nintendo 2. It also came with the Consumer Information and Precaution Booklet. You know, some manuals that nobody reads. But since this is an old system and it's bringing back memories, I might read all the manuals that it came with. It also comes with the Super Nintendo instruction manual, which is in black and white. It has Mario on the back. If you guys want, you can try calling that number, see if they still work. And then it had the consumer parts list and order form for the Super Nintendo. Okay, there is some color showing you Super Mario World. But mostly you see like black and white. And then we also got this. Now that you have your new system, we'd like you to deliver even more power for free. So this is the Nintendo Power. Okay, and I'm glad it's, it seems like it's not used. Nope. So what you would do is you would open right here, send this in, fill out your information, and then they would give you Nintendo Power Rewards. Now we have the system. It has some styrofoam from the box, but it is in good condition. So we take a look at the front. The only thing is here It has the LED right there, the two controller ports, which it seems like they're starting to turn yellow because this console did turn yellow because of the plastic that they used. For the side, it didn't have anything, just these ridges right here. For the back, there's that phone number with Mario with the screwdriver, the multi-out, for the AV cables, the RF out for the coaxial cable. And for this system, you did have to tune in to channel three or channel four. And then here is the AC adapter for the DC in to connect it to power. Now for the bottom, we do have this port that was never used here in North America. It was only used like in Japan and so. And then this is all the information for the Super NES control deck. And you always wanna make sure that that code matches with the code on your box. If you are getting a boxed console, that means that it is the original. And for mine, it does match. So if you can see this code here, this is my box, and the code here matches. So that means this is the original system that came with that box. And then for the top, we start at the back. We get the Nintendo logo right here. We get the 
SNES cartridge slot, which is pretty clean inside. We get the Super Nintendo Entertainment System logo, power on and off, eject, reset, and then for the other side, it is turning yellow here, but other than that, it's good, and then it does have the ridges. So let's go ahead and hook up this system and see if it works and if it powers on. So for my system, I am going to connect it via AV with the AV cables. So let's go ahead and hook that up. Next, I am going to connect the power like so. Next, I'm going to insert this game, which came with the system, which is Donkey Kong Country. I just took off the dust cover and popped in the game over there in my system. So let's go ahead and pop in next the controllers. So now I'm going to go ahead and connect the controllers. I will connect both of them to test them out and see how they work. So let's go ahead and get started with that. So now that everything is connected, it's time to turn on the TV and tune to the correct channel. So now I'm going to go ahead and turn on the system because it is off right now. That's why it says looking for signal and I'll be right back. And there you go. We get some power. We get some gameplay. This is Nintendo Presents. Donkey Kong Country. So that is going to be it for the unboxing. Hope you guys liked this video and don't forget to comment down below, subscribe to my channel, hit that bell notification and let me know what other games you would like me to play or show on my channel for the Super Nintendo. Peace out.